Yeah, just three POB, heading out through the Bowentown Bar, uh, crossing around by Muscle Rock. Got a nice little burly bomb situated here. Just um, just parked up on about 30 meter mark. Sand bottom. Just getting ready to chuck this down to the bottom and hopefully have something come along and burly up and be interested. Try this and then we'll go go have a ticky tour around the coast. Um, Got another little spot that I wanted to see today that could hold some p potential, eh? There we go. Oh, good old lead weight, say. Yeah, get it right down to the bottom. Oh, I'll give it lots of line. Pick a, pick a bottle. Who do you think is going to hook first, Cal? Who do I think is going to hook first? Yeah. I don't know. I think Liam's still got to get his first fish on a boat, I think as far as I understand, so that could be quite a good good little thing, but um, I think it's going to be one of the veterans today. Come on. Feels like a snapper. Yeah? Yeah. It doesn't feel massive, the wheels just play up to it. Oh, cuda. What we want. Barracuda. Barry. With pest fish, you just want to dispose of them. We'll keep this. Yeah, but it's good bait. Heck yeah. Nice boily fish. Yeah. Little barracuda. So, what a barracuda is, is they're normally more of a deeper. Oh, you mean that hook? Um, more of a deeper water species. Um, the old barracuda is quite cool. They've got they're very slender, as you can see, very shiny um, uh, outside as well. And what that does is it reflects, so it's their protective mechanism. Um, sharp teeth, though, so you've got to be incredibly careful with those chompers. Um, razor sharp and. Yeah, excellent bait for your deep drops. So for your harpooka, blue nose, um, even your broad bull at times as well. Really oily baits, nice long big baits. As you can see, you can see the slime literally dripping off them. Um, so yeah, so we just, little dommy knocker on the head, save him for bait for later. Uh, probably not today, but you know, in the future. Yeah. <laughs> The old bait runner 4000 Shimano, can't beat it. Got colour, nice little snapper. Oh, beautiful. Target species. So, veterans 2 0. Veteran 2 0 to the beginner. You chuck me that tail. Look at that, nice table fish. Just as we were discussing, might change spots. Check making a cutting plan when this happens. Whoa! How good. How you feeling, Liam? Got it, man. Bugger! Good it's... start, though. Hey, you've hooked your first fish. Yeah, it's good. It's a good start.
Hamish is just hoping to get that hook back on his other line. Yeah. Let's get it back. <laughs> okay. That's all right. Good. Happens. Happens. That's fishing. That's why it's fishing, not, not catching. catching. We'll be back. Color? Yeah, got color. What are we looking like? Snapper. Got those real big head knobs. Oh wow, that's a nice fish. Some nice coloration. Oh. Another beautiful East Coast spring snapper. Well, what's the score now? It's four. Four nil. Can't complain with a fish like that, eh? Good pan size. Good pan Beautiful size. Beautiful eating. Fun will be happy. What do we got, Liam? I don't know yet. Find out. First fish of the rod? Hopefully. Just keep that tension on. We're good. That tension. Beautiful. How's new what, what a birthday present, eh? Yeah. Yeah, another lead. Did me in well. Oh, is that colour? Yeah. What are we looking like? Nice snapper. Oh, beautiful. I'll come in and grab that beautiful for you. Beautiful wee fish. Sit back, bro. Yeah. Still recording. No, all good. I'll stick it. Happy? Yeah, bro. This is awesome. Good size as well. What do you want to do with it? <laughs> I want to eat it. Yeah. <laughs> hey. Good boy. Good lad. That's the answer. Good lad. On to another nice, decent pan snap, by the sounds of it. Feeling good. Looking good. Look at you. He's not feeling like a monster, but he should be a good eating fish. What setup you got there, Cal? It's the uh, classic bait runner. Beautiful. Trusty. He's actually a beautiful sized fish. Go. Look at that. Here we are. Just hold the fish, make sure I get it get it right. There we are. You see that just instant discoloration around the knife, plus that little flick. It's nice and coming pale a little bit through. So what that does is that just preserves the flesh of the fish um, to make it last a bit longer and it kind of also just gives a bit of a neurological relaxing through those muscles as well. So it's a perfect way to look after your fish, make them taste that a little bit better and keep them nice and fresh. I need to yeah, do that to <laughs> <laughs> Fish. Oh, beautiful fish. That is oh, awesome. done, boy. Happy man. Happy man. Happy oh. Sapper. No. <laughs> <laughs> Good fish, bro. Good fish. What happened, Liam? We weren't quite ready. I don't know what happened. Pulled out the bacon egg pie, the old, the old favourite. And the fish started biting, and Liam was mucking around, dropping oh, them all the time. It's, it's like the bacon and egg buddies with the ducks. Exactly. Once you open that up, they just start it coming. All hell starts flying loose. But Liam just couldn't execute. All right. It's becoming a bit of a trend today. <sighs> no, we, we, just because we don't film you missing them. No. <laughs> oh, there we go. There it is. Hey, I've been helping, okay? Yeah, yeah. Oh, I must say, someone needs to wipe me out. This is a bloody good boy. <laughs> you heard it here first, ladies. Hamish, <laughs> Hamish will cook for you. Yep, yep, just take it time. Oh, nice, Liam. Good fish, boy. He's good on to fish. a good one. Good fish, Liam. Just take your time, let it run. You're on yep. sand, remember? So. 
Oh, <laughs> oh yes, boy. boy. We He's trying saying, to go bigger again. We were just saying it's about time the big boys turned up. Good, man. Might be a netter. Yeah, it might be. Let's keep that tension in yeah, yeah. The improvements through the day might mean he lands it. Good start. How you feeling? Oh, I don't know. They're going slack pretty quick. Yeah, it's slack tired now, really. Yeah. That's right, early up hard. We'll be here till the end. There we go. Just uh, shifted spots. Gone from low to high, now we're going from high to low. Just changed up for the afternoon. Little fishy mabob, maboba. Um, caught some liveys, which was really nice. So we got one of them out under a balloon. Uh, so hopefully, a big old green belly kingy will come through and slam it. Um, or even a big, oh, big yeah, <laughs> even a big rocky. Um, Big snapper, kelpie, yeah, yeah. rock snapper. Yeah, yeah. Um, big old noggin on him. Yeah, got a real nice little outcrop. Um, yeah, a good bit of swell and upwelling of nutrients, and hopefully we'll yeah. have a bit of success come with that. Yeah, yeah. just having a bit of play around there. It's gonna burly up real hard and chum up a little bit. Chum up and entice the bite. Yep, it's good. Right, we've just uh, come up onto a bit of a workup. Hame has dropped the live bait over the side and uh, I've chucked a big snapper bait on, hoping to hopefully get down past all those bait fish and see what's underneath. But um, we're actually running out of light now, so we're just trying uh, one last wee quick, quick push, a little bit of a Hail Mary and uh, see how we all go.